Hi, this is Jenny the Happiness Wrangler at MLSDelivery.com. This video is dedicated to celebrating Ricoh's Theta's 360 camera and its use for real estate photography. Real estate photographers provide the first marketing engagement with a buyer. We capture the buyer's attention with rich visual information about the property. Add a 360 and it becomes a dynamic interactive experience immersing the viewer in the home allowing virtual exploration. As residential real estate photographers we find there's much to love about this little consumer camera. Our gear cost us $514 and we've included a list in the description of this video. Composition is significantly different on a 360. You're creating an interactive relationship to the objects in the room, including the ceiling and floor. So shooting from a perspective that makes you feel like you're in the room works best. Our monopod is set to a height of about 50 inches, making the native view of the image just below eye level. I don't like setting the camera directly on a counter or tabletop because it blocks too much of the surrounding area and the floor. My main point is to position the camera slightly above your targeted view. Place the camera a foot or two away from large furniture but close to the center of the room. If the room features an interesting ceiling or skylight, I place the camera slightly off from direct center. Chandeliers, fans, and light fixtures look great when you are slightly off and below the target. Exterior composition requires that you consider the sun and place the camera where you can minimize the flare, which can be quite bad on a Theta V. I fully extend the monopod for exterior shots. I like to have the camera either in complete sunlight or complete shade. Use the Theta app's live view to find the best camera placement and height for each shot for your location. Note of caution. I love the sleek result of my footed monopod, but it tips over easily. Always place your stand on level ground. The Theta loses Wi-Fi connection if you wander too far from the device or around the corner. If you're shooting in the open, be prepared to Photoshop yourself out in post. A good tip is to take a picture standing in front of one lens and then click off another while you're standing in front of the opposite lens. Load the images into Photoshop as layers and erase yourself. The Theta outputs a single JPEG image, so post-production processing takes about the same amount of time as a single image file. Processing images using Camera Raw, I apply a preset and white balance. Then I make any local adjustments I think are necessary. I manually move the images to the order I want them displayed in the tour and renumber. The next step is to batch save without resizing the image or modifying the metadata. To make my life easier, my batch save inserts a 360 in front of the existing name so I can easily find them. Log in to your MLS delivery account. Expand the property menu and choose add new property. Complete the address and agent fields. Choose your video source. Enable the map and click the orange Add and Upload Media button. This launches the Property Media Manager work area. Make the first tab active by clicking 360. Click the main work area and navigate to your 360 images stored on your computer's hard drive. Select and click Open to launch the image upload. While that's processing, Click the Images tab and upload your still images. If you inadvertently upload a 360 file to the still image area, delete it as it will not look right in the tour. When the uploads have completed and processed, it's time to link your images. From the Images tab, select those that you want linked to a particular 360 by clicking on the image thumbnail. This highlights the thumbnail box purple. At the right side top of the Image Manager work area, click the purple Assign 360 button. This launches the 360 selection pop-up. Choose the related 360 images and then click the Assign button. 
you may have multiple images linked to One360. The Property Media Manager work area displays images linked to a 360 with a purple banner. If you mislinked an image and need to edit your 360 assignment, click the three vertical dot button in the image thumbnail box to delete the link or change it to another 360 image. When you're satisfied with your tour, click the green publish button. You and your client will receive a delivery notification text and an email with a link to your agent page so that you can view, share, and embed the virtual tour and download your still images. Thank you for watching our video. We love the Rico Theta and its ubiquitous application that puts innovative, easy to use technology in our hands. Thank you, Rico.